Welcome to this Windows channel and this is another antivirus test. We're testing different antiviruses, some that you have, of course, um, asked for and some that were in my list. So this one was in my list. This is Dot32, one of my favorite antivirus. So I was curious as of February 2016 how it would fare, how it would work. Is it still one of the best for me? So, uh, not 32 not meaning no open doors, it is a antivirus by ESET. And of course, the link to the download page will be in the description below the video if you are interested in purchasing this paid antivirus. Now, I've uh, done, of course, the standard tests that I've done on all other antivirus software. First of all, not 32 has no junkware, nothing bad, nothing to add, nothing to say, nothing to, you know, just be annoying. It is plain, good, easy install. Uh, the only question I had to answer really was, do I want ESET, uh, not 32, to check for unwanted programs in my system? And there was a yes or no, and that's it. It didn't really uh, ask for anything else. So, you know, particularly uh, easy to install. ACAR file test was amazing. Uh, as soon as I wanted to save the, the file with the virus string inside it, it immediately said, virus removing. It never even showed up on my desktop, so protection was amazing with that. Download of the zipped file immediately said, download stop, this contains a virus. They never did show up, even on the computer, the connection was blocked, meaning that it not only, you know, it didn't let it go to the computer to have it uh, then checked and removed, it didn't even download because it just blocked and said, hey, this is a virus. Malware didn't even, I wasn't even able to download my two software. Immediately when I got to the page, it said, Oh, this is a page of a known malware. And when I clicked the download button, it said, no, connection is blocked. You're not allowed to download it. It did give me an option, though. It did say, if you really want to, yeah, you can download it. But you know what? I'm blocking this. So that's amazing. And it's one of the best protections out there for that because uh, it's the only one that really blocked the page and said, no, no, you can't download from here. It's, it's too dangerous. So that is pretty pretty cool I must say uh, this is not the full package it's only antivirus it doesn't contain a firewall because I am still pretty much convinced that uh, with a router and um, even the Windows firewall you really don't need any third-party firewalls it's uh, completely useless from what I would think the scan of the 2.3 gigabyte file was the slowest of all though uh, five minutes instead of uh, the average two to three minutes. But I noticed that when it did scan, it really, really took more time in the executable, exec, executable files and the zip files. These are the two files that it really, really stayed there a long time. So I would say that, yes, yeah, scan is slower, but it probably is deeper and much more uh, interesting in finding something that would be wrong in these files. Processor is less than 2% used with this antivirus, very, very low footprint. In memory, it does take always a lot of memory, uh, around 140 megabytes. That's a little higher than the uh, average, but you know, with today's computers, including mine with 8 gigabyte of RAM, it doesn't really impact at all. Startup impact is low, one of the lowest of all the antivirus that I've used. Uh, and uh, even the antivirus protection itself loads faster than pretty much all the antivirus I've tested up to now. The web impact is slight. We do see that there's a slight impact on the pages when you go on the web, but I've noticed that it seems to get better. So it probably learns from the pages that you go to and eventually it is actually very fast so probably it kind of learns uh, really what's good and what's bad in the pages that you would go and visit 
and after a while it really becomes very very fast so basically it is quite fast in pretty much everything that I've uh, clicked and done so um, really low impact on the web uh, after um, probably um, you know two or three uh, times that you went to different websites it actually really really becomes fast overall uh, you know uh, with all the tests that I've done this seems to be still one of my favorites of antivirus and the 2016 protection not 32 is amazing and uh, it is a paid antivirus but if you're looking especially for business purpose if you are a business owner if you use your computer for business sharing files and documents with others um, and you're wondering protection this is one of the best out there right now and uh, I still think that the 2016 version of not 32 is very amazing uh, you know it's almost as if you don't have an antivirus uh, when you're using your computer because it's just so uh, it's its footprint and the whole system is very very low so it works really well and this is a really great software there's a lot of little tools here like protection statistics uh, you know file activity the running processes in computer there's all sorts of little things that you can check you can schedule of course um, uh, a scan every you know day week or whatever there's the uh, system rescue live which is a malware cleaning tool uh, a lot of little uh, cool cool little things there uh, in this version so ESET's not 32 uh, clearly one of the big winners once again for me and one of the best antivirus out there uh, I'm amazed at how well it actually handled all the uh, viruses and malware I tried to send to it so uh, if you're looking for a paid protection that's real good I think this is a winner and of course wait till I've done all the antivirus and you can actually choose with my top uh, I'll see as a top five or top three antivirus and uh, let you all know what I think if you enjoy my videos why not subscribe to my channel you'll be informed when new videos are online if you have any comments questions suggestions maybe an antivirus I didn't do yet and you want me to try let me know and we'll uh, try to post the video online thank you for watching and uh, give us thumbs up if you like the videos and hope you enjoy the series of antivirus anti-malware software testing.